So here we have the latest uh, software update. This is 2019.20.4.1 and uh, I'm sitting in a Tesla Model S 100D in Switzerland uh, which has AP 2.5. Uh, so, uh, this is the much-awaited beach buggy racing um, uh, Tesla edition. Um, but interestingly, they've also updated the application launcher, and we've got this new display brightness, um, which I've not really played with yet, and the uh, dog mode uh, improvements that were in the last version. Um, but just looking at the... Um, here we go. So if I look at the launcher, so down at the bottom here, um, we have the the same old launcher, but it's changed the items in here. They've added, I think, charging. I don't think that was in here before. It's still at the top, um, but you've now got charging in here, which is very handy. Um, you've also got your calendar, your energy, your web, your camera, everything the same as normal. The call with this ridiculous icon. I don't know when they're going to get rid of that. I'm sure there's plenty of... Um, younger owners who have no idea what that creature is. Uh, then you've got the toy box, which is kind of cool. That just links you back to um, the familiar screen. So it's just this one here. Um, then you have the arcade. Now arcade goes straight into the games. So that's kind of cool. It means that you don't have to go via the toy box or the Easter egg box. Um, you can go straight in. It's a bit weird that the launcher seems to disappear after a few seconds i'm just noticing there which is a little bit annoying if you're not quite sure what you want to get i guess if you're driving along you look back up the road you look down again uh, it's gone again so that'd be quite strange maybe it's long enough so go into the arcade and here you have beach buggy racing 2. so if we click that one blah 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 drive cart touch screen and steering wheel now, I read um, a tweet a reply from the developers that actually they're working on a USB game controller support, which would be very cool if you and your passenger considered a supercharger on a long trip and you can play a bit of beach buggy racing. I guess you won't have actually done any driving because Autopilot's taken care of that, so um, you may as well practice your driving at the supercharger. So here's obviously the disclaimer. Um, and what I've done is, uh, in order to keep everything safe, I've actually left my charge cable plugged in. And that means that I can't possibly drive anywhere. So that's a handy tip for those of you with kids. Uh, if you leave the charge cable uh, connected, even if it's just your UMC not plugged into the wall, it will completely disable the um, high voltage motors and there's no way that anything can move. So, let's have a go. Oh, it's put me... Yeah, it's Vector Unit are the developers here, and those are the guys that replied to that tweet. So it's actually put me into my driving position, which is quite a nice touch. Okay. That loads pretty quick. So it's quite nice that it's a, quite a good representation of your own car. You can't move it. Um, obviously got the supercharger there, it's pretty good. Um, Shame he hasn't got my arachnid wheels, that would have been a nice touch, but hey, you know, maybe we're asking for too much there. So settings, maybe if I turn the music off. Uh, steering sensitivity, we'll leave everything there. Um, extras, so it explains the power-ups, credits obviously, and a full reset to remove all your progress. Um, and the menu there, oh, that goes back out, okay. Ah, that's cool, it keeps it in memory though, nice. Um, then, if I hit one player, uh, I'm going to be the male person. So you've got chill, performance, or ludicrous. I guess that's the difficulty setting. And then you've got all the levels that obviously I've not unlocked anything yet. Um, and if I go to chill, let's start off easy, shall we? So nice, smooth graphics. Really, really, really smooth. That's really cool. Um, so race your Tesla to the finish line. You've got steer left, steer right, brake is brake, and accelerate is automatic. Activate your power-up slots, okay, so you've got two available slots, that's cool. Use a driver's special ability once per race. Uh, third place or better, okay, cool. So let's see. Try using the steering. 
Okay, so the power steering is on, Whee! which means I guess um, we're going to have some wheel scrubbing. I know some people have got a bit upset about that. So there's definitely the possibility that the um, your actual front wheels will get scrubbed a bit. Now, I don't know how to use anything. I think you probably can use buttons for that, but I'm trying to do this one-handed while I film. Um, but there you go, you get the hang of it. It's actually not too bad to control. I'm really not a gamer, um, and so this is this is cool that I'm largely managing to keep it on the road whilst talking and filming and all that other stuff. So yeah, it's looking cool. Uh, I'll put those on, why not? Uh, looks really good. It's quite fun, actually. I haven't really been someone who uses the uh, the games in the car very much at all. Uh, it's, a, it's a tool for me. I drive to work and then I come home again. Um, but um, this looks quite fun. I think I could play that. Uh, it'd be nice to see what it's like with a game controller. Although I do like the steering wheel. I just don't like the idea of uh, causing extra wear on very expensive 21 inch tires. But there you go. So if I can maybe get to the end of the race. Oh, I see. That was someone else's. Uh, I can see through this chicken. <laughs> okay, cool. Flower pots. Mystery stuff. Okay, there's no one in front of me, obviously, because we're just doing all the winning. Uh, what the... Okay. Spoke too soon there. Oh, I see. Someone's shooting me from behind. Crikey. Let's get out of here. Am I going to win? Am I going to win? Yay, we won. Okay, cool. So I haven't been able to name myself, um, but maybe we can do that later. Oh, let's see. Cool, so now I've got a new track available, that's excellent. And a new player, so that's also cool. Beach Bro. So if I then go to one player, I guess I'll have, there you go. So we've got the Beach Bro available, and then we've got a new track. There you go, cool, so looks pretty good. Um, and then if we ex oh, exit out, it's nice and quick. And it goes back into my easy entry position. So there you go. Sorry for the long video, but um, super cool. Looks really nice. I like this update. Obviously, I've not driven it yet because it's, um, well, <laughs> it's 12.30. I have a newborn baby, so that's early in the morning for me. Um, and I'll go and test drive it at some point over the next few days.